my show channel. I'll be showing um Lego Harry Potter eight plus you know, eight to fourteen seven five nine five three Hogwarts Whomping Willow. Whomping? Like uh, Womp? I don't know what that means. Okay. So, 753 pieces. Ooh. Um, I already need to hand over the box to you because I don't know who the first figure is. Okay, I will read the names. Which figure is it? The, the guy? first one. Angus Filch. Um, here's Angus Filch. And now I could, I, now I can read it, I can read it now. You should know who all the rest are, right? Here's Angus Filch. Hello. Oh, and I meant to um, say here's the instruction books. There they are. One and two. This one came with two instruction books. Because it's bigger. Yeah. All right. There's Angus. Oh, he won't stand up. But... He's a lantern. He is. Move the box out of the way. Oh. There you go. Um, Professor Snape. Snape. Yes, we know Snape. They've seen Snape before. Um, Who else? Seamus Finnegan. Seamus. Seamus Finnegan. Seamus Finnegan. Okay. He's one we haven't shown before, so let's show him. No? Okay, you just leave him. No, um, he came in the green Slytherin book. Oh, okay. But his face was like... Oh, Hermione Ganger. Ganger. Oh. That was a little fish piece I found on the floor. Oh. Hermione. On the chair. Here's Hermione. Um. Ron Weisla. Why is he so scared? Well, doesn't he have two faces? Yeah. Right, so don't use the scared face. Yeah, but I'm going to set it up where they're um, in a play feature. Okay. And the man himself, Voldemort. No. Um, Harry Potter. Now, which movie is this from? The or Chamber book. of Secrets. It, There's all, a lot of sets from Chamber of Secrets. All of the sets, all of the Harry Potter sets are based on the movies. Yeah, but, I mean, there's a lot that came from Chamber of Secrets. You got, like, three sets. I have the Chamber yeah. of Secrets. <laughs> yeah. Polly, po Polly Juice Potion, Fluffy Encounter, the Chamber of Secrets. Okay, what else? Who else came with it? Um, Quidditch, I think. Who else came with it? That's it. That's it? Who are those extra guys? Um, I'm, I'm just going to show them because cause they're Harry Potter related. Okay. Um... There's a scene in Gobble the Fire that, um, that, um, um, what's his name? The guy that, um, comment down below if you know the guy that, um, in the graveyard duel. I don't. I've well, comment down only below. seen two movies. I don't know. Comment down below if you know the graveyard duel. Okay. Guy that dies. Okay. He's in. He's in the Hufflepuff and um. Here's here's Professor or um um Professor Sprout. Now she didn't come with the set. None of these guys came with the set. So. Yeah. Okay. Take the box off the table because it's um, taking up space. There you go. Death Eater. Okay. Professor Sprout wasn't in that scene, but I didn't have that scene, so I made it. Okay. Death Eater. Voldemort. Um. Still don't know that guy's name. <laughs> I don't either. <laughs> we and, could look it up. And? And Harry Potter and, and his wizard, and his tri wizard robes. Cool. These were, you got from blind bags? No, I just made these. Oh, you made these out of other sets? Mm-hmm. Okay, cool. The Harry Potter one, 
I just ripped off the dark, um, the dark red arms mm -hmm. from my chest Harry Potter and put black arms on it. Oh, okay. Mm. All right, so now, what does the set actually have in it? I don't remember what that guy's name is, but whatever. Now we're going on to the set. Um, here is the Ford Anglia. Ah, looks like the... Is that Ron's flying car? Or Ron's Whee! dad's flying car. Here's the Ford Anglia that came with Ford Privet Drive. They're basically the same. No. This one has... This one... These things are stickers, like these. Mm -hmm. And the whole, and the roof can come off. And still the same, two people can fit inside. Mm -hmm. um, but on this one, you actually take off the back of glass. Ah, look at that. Well, they look kind of the same. I mean, there's, there's a few different changes, but yeah, they basically look the same. So I will go put this one back in my city. Mm. Oh, and um, the back is different. Oh, yeah. This is the Ford Anglia from the Whomping Willow. And this is the Ford Anglia from the... Oh, suitcase um, fell out. <laughs> from the Ford Privet Drive. Oh, okay, so the trunks are different. Okay. This one, I actually... um, This trunk, I actually like better... Well, no, I actually like that trunk better, because if you want to not have the luggage in there, you could fit more things. But this one, it just has a bunch of cheese wedges, <laughs> or whatever those are called. Cheese wedges. Oh, comment down below and we'll link what those are called. So, I, I need I need the suitcases. Oh, and two suitcases are in the back of it. Cool. It's Harry's like actual luggage. Ah. After he escaped for Provit Drive. So. Okay, so that's the car. What else we got? A tree. Cool. Just a tree, or does it do something? It does something. <gasps> it spins. It's a magic tree. No. No? Um. Oh. You're not supposed to spin it super fast, probably. The reason why you might be seeing a hole um, is because that comes into play later. These things keep falling off. Well, then don't spin it. Or don't use the tree. Just use it as like a decoration if you want. I'm gonna actually display it with them with the car and the tree, so I might actually have to deal with those falling off. Mm. Um, the car. Come on. It's supposed to fit nicely in the tree. You guessed wrong. Oh. You guessed right. To all of you those out there that cheat it and already have that set, well then you don't need to guess. And if you want to, you can. Bam! Flo Ford Anglia in a tree. How did it get in the tree? Ron crashed it. How did he crash a car into a tree? It's a magic car. Oh, that's right. It flies. Don't forget. I keep forgetting his car flies. Cool. How does it do this thing? <laughs> okay. All right, so that's cool, but that's not all that comes with it. Oh, um, I actually need to get Ron and um, Harry. Oh, and I finally remember the guy, uh, the guy's name, Marcus Flint. There you go. See? 
I think. Um, so when he's crawling, um, the hole. Oh, so he can go in the hole. Yeah, I don't know why he would ah, be in the tree, but... Cool, man, because that's probably how he got out. It's probably a hole. It's, supposed to, it's probably supposed to be a hole in the top of the tree where he can slide, slide out. I always have... I always want to display it with, um... Like, I'm going to show you how I'm going to display it. With one door open... Oh, uh, so that it looks like they climbed out? Yeah. Okay. Just one door... Open. Ron just crawling out of the tree, and then Harry dangling from a branch. Let me actually get it in that pose now, so I don't have to um do it later. Like do it after. There you go. Ah. Hold on a minute. Okay. He might not stay on, but I got him on. Yeah, there you go. For now, anyway, you got him on. Don't play with him. If you keep touching him, he's going to fall off. I, you got to leave it alone. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> Have a nice ride, Harry. <laughs> Next. The castle. Get, get the tree out of the way. So, here is the castle. Um, let's start in this room. Can you spin it around so I can see it or no? Okay. I right, want you to do up close views. Okay. Oh, and I forgot to say, but the tree, but the car actually can go through here. Yeah, I figured that because it looked like it had two tracks. Yeah. Since that car is already in the tree, I'm probably just going to have to have this car... Um, on the table at all times, so I could show you if there's any car features. Whee! All right, all right. So show, start from over here and show us what it does. Okay, now I'm done with the car. There's no car right. features anymore. Start from over here. Um, this is Snape's office, okay. and there's that. There's what people used to write with, like feathers. Yes. Where you dip in ink. Uh huh. A quill. Yeah. A little lamp. Um. A weird shaped hammer. No, oh, oh, oh. don't move it. Just hold it still. Hold it still. There you go. And an axe. Okay. I don't know what he needs those for. To axe people. And a hammer and an axe. And two lights. Mm hmm. Um. Next is just nothing. So pass that room. This room. Oh, and if turn, you're. Turn it a little bit so you can turn it. Turn it. There you go. Right. If you're wondering what's in there. Brooms. It's a frog. Oh, it's a frog. Look at that. And then up top here, what's up top here? Beds? Here's a broom with like just a bunch of potions. Those are bedrooms with that um, Ron and Harry go in. Mm hmm. There's Hedwig. Oh, where? Up there. There he is. Oh. Um, I actually display my sets like this. Right. Like, so it's facing, like, out. Well, yeah, so that's... you're not able yeah. to see Hedwig. Right, well... But, um, wait, you still want to do that? Oh, there's la one last room, the final room, yes. Um, here's, like, where all the people do the potions. Oh, okay. Um, this looks like it was very difficult to put together. I'm gonna set them up, and that won't take long, so you won't have to pause. Okay. He goes there because he hears something and doesn't know what it is. I see on your other set you have the guys set up on their on the, the where they belong too. You can do that with all your Harry Potter sets. Yeah. And this table for some reason can come out, so you can show that in close detail.
Too bad we didn't have a big enough room where you could make all of Hogwarts area. I could. Where we could make a giant train and, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe one day when we when this channel becomes super famous and you make millions of dollars, then we can do it. But that's only going to happen if people subscribe, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, what do you tell people? Subscribe. Click the button. Click the button. I don't want to be that type of YouTuber. <laughs> Click the button. <laughs> oh, and um, for some reason, here's emeralds. That's an emerald piece used as, um, like, juice in the potion, in the... Really? Because in the, in the DC sets, that's kryptonite. Well, um, <laughs> in this, it actually is supposed to be just juice in the oh, okay. potion pot, like, Bubbling out. Oh, really? And okay. two pink studs holds it in, holds it in. So they're using kryptonite as their. Uh... Oh, and here's the stirring pole. Oh, the stirring pole. Everyone needs a stirring pole. There's two pots, one with the thing I just showed you, and one with the stirring pole, and a candle in between them both. Cool. So, here's everyone where they're supposed to be. That looks pretty cool. Wait, I need to put um this thing back. Oh yes, put the table back in. We'll do a close-up of everybody. Of everybody and where they are. Yeah, so there's Snape in his office, right? And then... There's the dude walking across the bridge. Hello. Oh, and this actually isn't a mold. Like, this isn't a whole head mold. Oh, now he has no hair. Put his hair back. He took his hair off. All right, who's down here? There's Hermione going to get a, one, of, one of the potions. And here's this guy. Right. There's Hermione. Hermione, and there's that dude. And Ron and him are in the or over here. Yeah. Yeah. There's there's Harry. Hello. Wait, wait, wait. Help me! Help me! And then there's Ron. Where's Ron? Help me! <laughs> They're both climbing out of the tree. Yes. I do not need the floor the floor to angle anymore. All right. So, would you recommend getting this to other Lego fans for your their Harry Potter sets? Yeah. Do you, do you think this adds to the castle, or is it just making it way too big? It just makes it way too big. <laughs> pan over to my um, Hogwarts over... Yeah, that's a pretty big set you yeah. got there. That's an entire basically, folding table. Basically, to me... Can they see me? Yes. Basically, to me... Whoops. Oh, that I fell down. That's, um, what I just picked up is uh, actually a statue. It's not a guy. Oh, okay. But to me, Hogwarts starts here and ends all the way over to the Quidditch. There you go. See? All right. So make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.